Could you have ever imagined when you started playing there'd be a seniors poker tour just like golf? Oh, goodness, no. The, the changes in poker, particularly since the year 2000, have been beyond my even fantasizing of what good could happen to poker. My, my, my hope from when I started playing seriously, which was late 80s, early 90s, was just to get more women involved. And that has certainly happened. So many great players. It's just that the, the men outnumber the women by a lot. Right. Statistically, if we were 50-50, you see a lot more women and a lot more winning uh, first places and championships and so forth. Well, I'll tell you what, I don't think we're too far off the day we're going to see a woman win the main event of poker. I, I don't think that's too far off now. Yeah, I think it'll happen also. I also do not think that a senior will ever win it again. Now, that's because of stamina. We're going to talk about that because you're gearing up for the World Series of Poker, as a lot of poker players are, and these are long events. This is a true grind, isn't it, this World Champ? You bet. It, it, it certainly is, Derek. You just you have to be in good shape, but you also, also have to have age on your side. And, and when you get to a certain age, there's just so much you can do. When I run into people that I haven't seen in 10 or 15 years, hey, Cindy, what have you been up to? Well, I have been up to the same thing I've always been up to, just less of it. <laughs> I can't do big tournaments back-to-back -back anymore. I've got to get a few days in between. Yeah, you spoke about that the last time you were on. We had Robert Turner on the show the other day. He won a bracelet in 93, introduced the game of Omaha. He finished 97th in the main event in 2005. That's the year of Joe Hashem. 5,700 runners in that main event. He said by the third day of no sleep and fatigue, he was done. And it's his one regret. He wishes he would have prepared his body better. You can understand that feeling, right? Oh, absolutely. If you're prepared, at least you can give it your best. But if you're not, and, and these kids that come to town and party and drink and race hell all night and then go to play a tournament during the day, good for their opponents because they're not going to be on top of their game. I mean, it's like an athlete preparing for an event. you got to be ready. And just to give an example of how people are paying more attention to their diet and exercise and having their bodies ready for the World Series, there's a, a food truck, and I can't remember the name of it, but uh, he takes orders via text, and you text your table number, seat number, and they bring the food in, the healthy food. And that doesn't necessarily mean, you know, um, not tasty. It's just not hamburgers and french fries. It's uh, free-range chicken and salads and so forth. Any little tiny edge helps, but not a day or two before. I've been preparing for the World Series basically all year, but certainly in the last six months. Give yourself every opportunity to be on top of your game and to be ready and you know, like I say, any little tiny edge might win the, the key pot of the tournament. We're talking about the Seniors Poker Tour. Is that why there's a need for the Seniors Poker Tour, do you think, because of these longer events and perhaps the 20, 24-year-olds, they have the advantage? Oh, I don't necessarily think they have the advantage. I find it a slight disadvantage to play with some of them because, to me, they're just so aggravating. <laughs> when it's not necessary... Uh, so much I can say about the young people. I really think the Senior Poker Tour was initially developed just to increase numbers. And I don't even remember the first year they played it, but I do know that it almost doubled in number. In numbers just a few years ago, it went from like 2,500 to over 6,000 players. But uh, that's one reason the Senior Poker Tour was developed. The Senior Poker Tournament at the World Series was so popular. It is my absolute favorite tournament and the reason is it's like old time poker because it's the old time players they're more relaxed there's none of this cocky business they're friendly uh, it, it's just it's a wonderful experience and I found the same to be true on the senior poker tour everybody is is friendly and kind they're there to win of course but they just don't have to go up against the, the little hoodies and backwards baseball caps and pants on the ground and the attitude